Hey, what's up, Jax? Jack43 here. Last time I know it cut off, but I'll pretty much he found us in the ocean unconscious, and now we need to get him a sail because he doesn't have a sail, even though he's a freaking boat that can talk. So yeah, we we are now on Windfall Island. As we get it, it's an island. So yeah. What? The, I did. I wasn't even trying to talk to you. Screw you. Uh. No, go away, old man. So yeah, let's go find where we can find this guy's sail. The, gosh dang it. Yes, I'm a tourist. No, I'm not a tourist. I'm an adventurer. No, shush. Ah, this looks like a shop. It's like a fine shop indeed. Hello. My story's a strange one. I came across cursed seas from a land far away. A land where the blizzards blow violently, heading for this town called Windfall. Dear me, my ship was torn apart by vicious winds, and this island is where I washed ashore. There was one other person with me. Yes, there was. But I dare say he was immediately arrested based on his somewhat suspicious looks and thrown right into jail. Yes, just locked up somewhere on this island. Needless to say, I'm really worried about him. Uh, needless to say, I'm really worried about him. Would you be so kind as to help free him from captivity? Indeed, it would be appreciated. <sighs> Fine. Stupid old man. Let's find the prison. Great. Is this the prison? It looks dull, like a prison should. It shouldn't attract people's attention. Yeah, this is a prison. Tingle. Gosh dang it. What? Hmm, I see the same green clothes and the same green hat. By the look of you, I'd say, Sir, could you by chance be a fairy? No. Goodness! Did you feel my telepathy? That's why you saved me, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? No, it's not. Your friend asked me to. Do not worry. Tingle knows, a, knows without you telling him, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, gosh dang it. Tingle is my name. I have been looking for you and your kind for I too long to be one of the fairy folk. No. And yet I was mistaken for some kind of troublemaker and put into this dreadful sort of place. How disrespectful. Good. <sighs> Please, Mr. Fairy, rescue poor Tingle from this place and take him where you and your kind live in splendor. I will not take you anywhere, but considering I need you free to get the sale, fine. Hooray, thank you so very much. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. Get out of here. Here's Tingle's heartfelt gift of thanks. Tingle, Tingle. Kulu Limpa. Become an item. You got a Tingle. Tingle, what are you doing? Anyways, you got a Tingle bottle. Using Tingle bottle. Using Tingle bottles, you can do me verse things, take pictures, you know, show off pictures, just comments and stuff. Yes, I'm familiar with me verse. Leave. 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 I was forgetting something important. Oh, Mr. Fairy, you want to come to my island, don't you? Don't you? Don't you? No. Oh, well, Tingle, stop it. We got his chart, so we know exactly where his island is. Yeah, I, I know. I'll explain it when I get there. Shush. And if you like to give your tingle bottles that little extra oomph that all tingles crave, you should check the back of the cell. Check it right now. Check it out. Check it right out. Okay. You can now send letters in tingle bottles by using me verse. Allow tingle bottles. 
anyone. Hey, what's up, JaxJack43 here to bring you some more Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD version. Now, last time we had, I get, it got cut short, I'm sorry. So that's going to be like a two minute long episode. Now, I skipped recording me trying to go through that little maze because it's just really annoying for me. But yeah, this is in this was through a tunnel system in Tingle's cell. And it gives us the picto box. It's a thing you can use to take pictures and then in turn put those on Miiverse. Now well, the quickest way to get out of here is just to on purpose make a mistake and fall. Because that will take you outside to where the King of Red Lions is. Right here. And then you can just go over to the guy, the merchant, and say, oh yeah, I got your friend out. Give me a sale. Run away from the old guy as usual. And up here where... No, take my kids. Oh, and there he is. Really, you have rescued him. That is news I deem rather great. You are one stand-up individual. Indeed, you are. Now, I apologize, as I have but another favor. I'm actually considering starting up a stop here on the island, but I'm having trouble funding my venture. I have but one asset to my name. I wonder if you might buy it from me, perhaps. The people on the island have no interest in venturing out into these dangerous seas, so my chance of selling it to them is rather bleak, the weakest I can describe. So probably it's the sale. I'd really like to ask 200 rupees for it, but as a favor for us and my friend, perhaps we may strike a deal. How does 80 rupees sound? I'll buy it. Why you don't have enough rupees? Gosh dang it, let's go get more rupees. How many do I have? 54. Okay. Um... Fifty-nine, sixty. I need eighty. Gosh dang it! Stupid merchant. Okay, and also there's some side quests involving the picto box. So yeah, you can also do those in town on Windfall. I'm probably not gonna do those, at least not on screen. Hmm, where's somewhere else with pots? Siddle, siddle, sidle, go, young link, go, 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 come on. Almost there. Why is this so agonizingly? There we go. Whoa. Ah, yes, pots. 65. 66. Oh, root 66. I had to. Crawl in here and what we find. We find more pots. Sixty-eight, sixty-nine, seventy. Ten more. Come on. What? Ninety. Score. Ninety-one. Let's just get everything over here, and that's it. So ninety-one rupees. <laughs> Screw you too, man. Gosh, bomb seller. I bet he has a really explosive personality. Huh. <laughs> okay, let's get back to the merchant. No, go away, old guy. 
Yeah, he's not worth your time talking to. Trust me. It's just not worth it. On my first round of playing this alone. But Masuf, I thought he was. Nope. Wrong. How wrong I was. Come on. Ooh, please buy that from me. I will. I'll buy it. Yes, 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 thank you. You're welcome. And yep, the sale. Yes, yes, you have made a good purchase today, my young master. As you have saved my life and business as well as treasure it dearly, it is the finest sale in the world. No, not true anymore with the HD version. Treat it as such. And yes, I do know about the Swiss sale. And it won't be a while until I get it just to make sure that I have a bunch of rupees because seriously you need a lot of rupees because you have to outbid people and a tingle bottle I will show those maybe at the end of the video if I remember oh that look in your eye so you found yourself a sale have you very well then I shall teach you the art of sailing it's not that difficult come next to my hole and press A to climb aboard Urgh. hoist the sail you got with A to get moving the sail will catch the wind which will push the boat forward the arrow that appears behind me indicates wind direction. Use L to steer. Oh my gosh. I know. Okay. If you really much to go by, you will be at the mercy of the sea chart. Okay. Oh my gosh. Shush. Okay. And I will not be showing the Wii U gamepad because just with how I do this, it, I won't be able to. But we had to go two blocks to the right. So two blocks, huh, coincidentally in the same direction as the wind. Let's us be on our way. Whoosh. Yeah, this is going to be a lot of the game, just whooshing. And that's why I'm going to be getting the fast sail, the super sail, whatever it's called. Because it just makes it sailing faster, easier. And there's also these little ruby, rupee challenges if you go through the things and then up, jump. It's kind of a waste of time, but eh, you get money. And a blue rupee if you successfully, you know, at the end of the run. And, up. See, blue rupee. Oh wait, there's another ah. Oh. Screw it. Let's just get over there. Hmm, I wonder if it's that giant island right there we're going to. <laughs> so yeah, now from now on probably the the videos will be long longer than 15 minutes just due to sailing and how long it takes. <sighs> so yeah. I'll find a suitable place to end this episode eventually. Come on. Here we are. I am now doing nothing. There, on the horizon. That is our destination, Jag Dragon Roost Island. Alright. Very nice. High atop this island's peak lives the spirit of the skies, a great dragon by the name of Valu. Cool. You must go see this dragon and request from him a jewel called Din's Pearl. I doubt it's going to be that easy, but okay. Ask the people of the Rito tribe who inhabit this island about how to see the dragon. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. Wait just a moment. This is the Wind Waker. It is a baton of sorts that was used long ago when the people played music in prayer to the gods. In those days, simply using it allowed one to borrow the power of the gods, but I do not know if it still works. It does. Even so, I thought it might be of some use to you. Perhaps you should try using it. Perhaps. And now, key mechanic of the game. Well, one of them. The Wind Waker. First conducted 3-4 time. 
Do not touch L, just try to match the rhythm by tilting the R up, down, right. Up, down, right. The first song we'll be using. Up, down, right. Oh gosh, I'm not going to sing, especially this late at night. Very nice, that was splendid. Next is 4-4 four, four time. Hold L to the left to change the rhythm, then match the rhythm and tilt the right stick up, right, left, down. 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 And that's it, Jack. That was not bad for your first time using Wind Waker. Not bad at all. You can also conduct with it in 6-4 time, but we won't need that for a while. But just to the left stick to the right. You would do well to remember that. You received the legendary Wind Waker. By using this magical conductor's baton, you can borrow the power of the gods. I thought they were goddesses, but eh. Use R to conduct. Don't tilt L. Tilt the left stick to conduct in 3-4. Tilt left stick to the left for 4 time. And tilt to the right for 6-4 time. Okay. So let us explore. Throw. Bomb flower. Oh, come on. That's poopy. Danger, do not attack the explosive fruit. What do you think the first thing I'm gonna do is attack the explosive Gosh dang it! Okay. Eh. Yeah. Explosions. And a rupee. For the troubles. Up. Boom. <laughs> and a rupee for my troubles. Oh gosh. What? Sign. Mail center is this way. Oh, do we get to see the bird man? Yay. I like the bird man. Go, 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 go. Aw. Oh. Come on. Hurry up. Thank you. Go, 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 go. Yeah. Up. Yellow rupee for my travels. Slowly, slowly, surely, surely. Okay, come on. Let's just let this blue rupee fall down. Now, for the sake of my things about to die, I'll end the video by showing off the tingle thing. If I can. <laughs> 